and welcome. I'm Sri Amirapu, Product Manager for Cloud Solutions at Renesas. Cloud is growing to be an indispensable part of IoT to manage the zettabytes of data produced by the tiny IoT devices. Such an important cloud deserves an equally magnificent evaluation tool. Renesas, for the first time, introduces an end-to-end -end cloud solution with its MCUs, analog and power devices, sensors, and connectivity modules combined into a single development kit. Please join me in unboxing our pride, the new cloud kits, CKRA6M5 and CKRA65N, based on Renesas RA6M5 and RX65N MCUs with RYZ014 AP mod, Renesas' first LTE CAT embed module. Also, for the first time, we're bringing together RA and RX MCUs onto a common platform to give our users an indistinguishable experience of Renesas' cloud connectivity. The kit contents for both CKRA6M5 and CKRX65N include the base boards, RYZ014A LTE CAT M1 PMOD, SIM card, antenna, and required connecting cables. The base boards are uniquely designed to bring out the best of Renesas MCUs and cloud services. The boards have an Arduino form factor with two PMOD connectors, allowing ample room for further expansion. The kits have five onboard sensors, temperature, barometric pressure, indoor and outdoor air quality, and optical sensor or a biometric sensor for pulse oxygen monitoring and proximity sensing. In addition, the kit also includes complete hardware and software support for nine axis MEMS sensor that can be either mounted or connected to one of the boards. There are two microphones to allow voice command support with cloud. It has three user LEDs, red, green, and blue, and one tricolor RGB LED. There are three USB connectors, one debug, one host, and one UART serial terminal. The kit has two options for network connectivity, an onboard Ethernet file and an RYZ014A cellular CAT M1 PMOD. The PMOD can be connected to either of the PMOD connectors for cellular connectivity. The kit also has provision for connecting a battery connector that can support three AA batteries to allow for mobility of the kit without the need for powering up the kit from the USB. The kits can be powered on using the debug ports. The kits are pre-programmed with quick start example projects. To run the project, connect the USB serial terminal to the computer for accessing the UI. On power up, please make sure to verify for the COM port in the device manager. Open any terminal interface like TerraTerm and choose the appropriate baud rate. On power up or reset, we see a self-explanatory menu with four options on the terminal. The first option provides the information of the kit. The second option provides the real-time data of the sensors present on the kits. Some of the sensors, like OB sensor, are simulated by proximity and the data can be seen when the finger is placed on the provided fingerprint molding. Some sensors, like ZMOD 4510, require longer training periods when the kits are powered on for the first time. The 9-axis MEM sensor data shows up as unavailable on the kits. The data will be populated when the kits are mounted with the sensor as shown. Option 3 on the main menu displays the web server information. On connecting the Ethernet cable and following the instructions, a DHCP connection is initiated. Upon completion of the connection, an IP address is assigned to the kit. Type the IP address in the web browser to see the kit information. The page also has a button to toggle the switch S2, which changes the frequency of the LED on the kits. Option 4 provides further information on the support available for the kits. For more information, please visit our Cloud Solutions webpage, renesas.com slash cloud solutions to download the Quick Start Example Project and other cloud connectivity applications. We hope you enjoy your cloud exploration. Thank you.